Hey there Dark Narker fans, I just came across totally randomly such a crazy little tidbit of information and insanely I think it pieces the picture of what Nexon is trying to do to Iron Mace. It, it takes that whole picture and puts it together and now it all finally makes sense. Some of you may have heard about a game called Arc Raiders. It is being developed by a, I think it's a Swedish studio, Embark Studios, and apparently they've got quite a list of established and experienced game developers, but here's the actual crazy thing. Nexon takes control of emerging game studio Embark, and who's making Arc Raiders? Embark Studios. Arc Raiders is the reason P3 was abandoned. Like this does not look anything like Dark and Darker, of course, but all of the resources that would have gone from P3 are likely going towards Arc Raiders, and this is the piece of the puzzle. Nexon doesn't actually think that they can beat Iron Mace in court. They were just afraid that Iron Mace was going to take all the players that would otherwise be going to Arc Raiders. And now that other titles uh, have come and gone, such as the Cycle Frontier, that is shutting down in September. If Nexon can keep Iron Mace from releasing Dark and Darker, and then this gets released, they will be the only players in the genre. And that has to be Nexon's goal. This all came about just because of a tidbit of information from the Star Siege Dead Zone Discord. Some players were talking about the Arc Raiders Alpha that is uh, currently closed, and that's it. I think we know their plan now. It's not surprising, and I don't know. We're already in this boycott of Nexon titles. Is this going to be included? Is this something you're going to be interested in playing? And we're going to find out real soon. That's it for now.